is Gabriella Amy Bonnell and Ella Chow with your breaking news update on the difficulties that people with invisible and visible differences face. These differences can lead to being bullied, teased, and low self-esteem. For more on this topic, let's turn to Sarah Hussein with an on-the-spot report. Thanks, Ella. And today I'm here with Alex, Abdi, and Emery. So, all three of you, would you judge somebody if they had a different look or act different? No. 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 Okay. <laughs> so, have you ever thought about what you would do if somebody did judge you? Yes. Yes. What would you do? If somebody judged me like this, I'll walk, I'll walk away. Do you ever have trouble making friends with somebody who looks different than you? Yes. Yes, yes. a lot of times. Mm. Okay, you heard their answers. So, but nowadays, education is trying to teach children not to judge somebody for their look or the way they act, but to be friends with each other. Thank you, and back to you, Ella. Thank you, Sarah, for that interesting report. We now hope that when you see someone, you don't think they're different, just unique. That was your See the News breaking update. Thank you and goodbye. Invisible and visible. What? <laughs> <laughs> and. One, you're doing the conclusion. Yeah, you're doing the conclusion. Oh! <laughs> Don't worry, we can cut that out. One. One! Nothing. <laughs> <laughs>